Hey guys, Chad Wesley Smith here doing some one minute Q and A. Andre Maurice asked about you know how I approach training coming back from an, from an injury. You know, I'm personally in that exact situation right now. Um, about 15 weeks out from two herniated discs, the seven millimeters at L4 L5 and uh, four millimeters at L5 S1. And you know, regardless of what the injury is or what the uh, the event that uh, you're, you're trying to compete in is a couple things will, will hold true no matter what. First, you need to identify really what the mechanism of that injury was. You know, why did that injury happen? What weakness, imbalance, whatever it may be that you have that, that helped contribute to, uh, to that happening. And, and once you've done that and, you know, set up a program to address those, uh, you know, mobility, stability issues, whatever it may be, um, you know, muscular imbalances and weaknesses, then, <laughs> You want to get into a high frequency, low intensity program that that allows you to, to mimic the the exercise you're trying to come back to um, in in a scaled way, basically. So if you're trying to sprint, all right, and you have, you have a pulled hamstring or a torn hamstring, even you know you need to get into into high knee marches, then high knee skips, then running high knees, then B skips, and then you know jogging you know, like running and then sprinting, you know, and that kind of skate will, will be similar exercise that will best prepare you to come back into it. You know, if, if you have an injured, injured back and you can't deadlift, all right, so maybe you're going to start from, you know, six inch block or eight inch block pulls, then six inch block pulls, then four inch, then two inch, and then pull off the floor again. You know, you need to put yourself in a situation where you can perform similar exercises to what, to what it is you're trying to come back to. Uh, just in a scaled down way that's not going to, you know, exacerbate the injury.